Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Christina and on my channel I share everything and anything. And by seeing on today's video, we are going to do a little video about how it's going with my business. So this, these types of videos belong to a playlist that I've called My Business Diaries. And I've been slacking on these type of videos on my channel, I have to admit. It's been other things that I've had to focus on in my life, but we're getting things going because everything is falling into place one day at a time. If you're watching this and you're a business owner, you don't have to be a business owner. If you're just chasing your dreams and trying to reach some goals, you know what I mean. You know, everything takes time, one at a time, some bumps along the road, have to prioritize different things, move them up the list, move them down the list. You get what I mean. So yes, um, I feel like doing this video now because I feel inspired to, and it's been other things going on in my life. Okay, you guys. So if you're not with the program now, if you don't follow me on my Instagram, particularly on my Instagram or even on my TikTok, um, I've launched a skin care line. I mean, I've launched skin skincare products on my online store, which is called Kivana. So if you're new here, go check that out on my Instagram, on my website, on my TikTok, whatever. Um, so go check that out. So I've launched that and that was like a week ago and that went pretty well. So that, you know, it, it went well. I don't expect like to sell thousands and thousands and thousands. It's a start, you know, and I try to remind myself, look at every entrepreneur it's like, you know, everything's a learning curve. Everything is a lesson. And um, yeah, just because having, how, how do I say it in the right way? It's, it's not a bad thing to kind of have a vision of how you want things to turn out, but it's okay to just let the ver universe take, take over. I can do what I can do. And then I release release it into the universe and we'll see what will happen and excuse all the noise in the background we are renovating and building out our home if you're new on this channel if you're not you already know that anywho i'm not trying i'm, I'm not going to make this video so long because i am a bit tired we just got back from a little festival um a motor festival so i'm a bit tired so my plan is to lay on the couch before bed bedtime and bedtime before dinner time you see how tired i am before dinner time and I thought I'd film this video now because I'm feeling quite good you know I don't wear makeup every day and I do use contacts nearly every day but I'm thinking I look a bit more presentable for this video and ignore the messy bed behind me okay whatever okay we are going to talk about one of the skincare products um, right now and um yeah just share to you guys if you're interested to to know you know i mean like what is what is products what is products it's like you're allowed to like more than one skincare product you're allowed to like one more like a bunch of different songs or a bunch of different series or clothing items it's like just because i've launched a skin care product line doesn't mean i'm never going to buy nivea's products i just think it's good to have an open mind and mix it up every now and then um and the story behind I mean, this has been in the works for oh, oh, a year now, a little bit over a year, um, creating products, skincare products for my online store. Because if you're new here, I I sell merch, I sell jewelry, I sell, sell ex hair accessories, and I want to broaden what I sell on my online store, okay? Um, I don't have a physical boutique right now, but that would be awesome. Um, so it's an online store. Um, anywho, the story behind it is that the quote is, and the story behind it, if I can't find it, I'll create it. And I've been, I haven't been a skin girly all my life, okay? I've been very neglected towards my skin and um, better late than ever. So that's why I've been searching high and low for something that works for me. And I finally have found a company that is helping me make my skin feel as good as it can. Because skin health, skin care is health care. Skin care is health care because your skin is a sponge. What you put onto it, you absorb, okay? And I just have to say this. If you can protect your skin 
by getting rid of a few bad ingredients, that is better than nothing, okay? I'm just saying, you can protect your skin from every single bad harmful thing in the world, but if you can minimize it, that's just a win already there, okay? So look up the ingredients in your skincare products, okay? Yes, it's a money issue, but do your research. There is some affordable products out there. And we should remember, skin products hold last pretty long, you know? Like if you think about sunblock. If you live in Sweden, how often do you sunblock? One month, maybe. <laughs> oh, well, okay, that's body sunblock I'm referring to here. But facial sunblock you should use every day. Anywho, getting off track and it's already been five minutes. Okay, we are going to talk about one of my products today. And it is actually, I'll, I'll put some videos and photos on the screen to make it not so boring for you guys. We are going to talk about, and excuse me, I'm looking down. I, I know my product through and through and off the bat, but I don't remember every single ingredient on the product, okay? So if you want to know more about my journey here and, and all that, like just, just comment down below. But I am more active on my Instagram, so just message me there, okay? And message me at itschristina.com, okay? Okay, we are going to... I have it in my jacket. We're going to talk about my sensitive skin cleanser, okay? The story behind why I wanted to create a sensitive skin cleanser is that I've tried the all, okay, the majority of skin cleansers that they sell at the groceries, right? And I have sensitive skin. I, I have combination skin and I have sensitive skin. And I am allergic to dust bugs. So I do, I can get like rashes on my face and little tiny spots on my face so it's been a hard now I sound like you know it's like the worst thing ever but it has been quite challenging finding the right product that suits me and that's what I'm trying to say is that have an open mind even you found even if you found the perfect product for you it's not a bad thing to have an open mind and try other products so the sensitive skin care cleanser is suitable for all skin types. I just want to really emphasize on that just because it's for sensitive skin girlies or boysies, you can use it if you have normal skin. I just want to put it out there that anyone can buy it. And the prices are affordable because when you buy a skincare product, you don't know until you try it. So all my products are very affordable, affordable because it's an investment to yourself. And yeah, it's like, it's a chance you, you take when you haven't tried anything new, right? So what is so impressive and innovative about this skincare cleanser is that when you, the, the actual cleanser reacts to water. So you will feel an oily texture, an oily, smoothing, cooling texture, and then it will transform into a milky texture. So this cleanser does not lather. And another thing is I have very sensitive eyes. I have very, very sensitive eyes. So as soon as I take, like I, I, I wash, or I normally start around my cheeks, my nose, my forehead. And then of course you have to go over the eyelids and the eyes area because there is so much sweat and debris that gets caught on your eyelashes because eyelashes are filters and everything just gets on them. So when it comes to face wash, my goodness, I'm so sensitive around my eyes. And that's also something that I really wanted to emphasize in this product to include in this product that it doesn't sting the eyes. Okay, you shouldn't have your eyes open when you have it there, but like even just the fact that it's around my eyes, it doesn't sting. So it's an innovative skin cleanser product, okay? So it doesn't lather because when you have lathering foam, for me, when I when I have the small tiny bubbles and I'm washing my face, the reason like that's why I wash down here first, then I do the forehead last and the eyes very last. So here first, here second, here third and last. Because when it lathers, I've noticed, like, if it lathers here, it can, like, seep down into my eye, like, the small bubbles, and it stings. Or even just the fact, like, these small bubbles pop. So that's why I thought it was very important to offer an, a different product in the market. A sensitive skin cleanser that doesn't lather. That's why I thought it was very important to offer something different out there. Okay, if you like it, you like it, and if you don't, you don't. But I mean... If I can't find it, I'll create it, okay? If you like your face washed to leather, fine, but have an open mind in life, okay? This could be even better for you. The bottle is 150 ml, so it will last you a long time. I mean, look at it. It's a mother of a bottle. So it's got a pump head, and honestly, I just pump once. I only pump once, and it's enough. It's totally enough. But I will just have to warn you, it is different when it doesn't lather, okay? Because I'm so used to the other face washes that I've used through many, many years that they lather. So it does feel weird. So 
it, it, it's enough with one pump, one and a half maximum, honestly. But you know, it's up to you if you want to take two pumps, but one, one and a half is enough. And so morning and night, um, I've been using it. I mean, when did I start using them? This is this bottle I started using a month ago and it doesn't feel even empty, you know? Anywho, um, yes, this sensitive skin care cleanser is vegan, nut free, gluten free, and organic certified, okay? I just want to put that out there. It is important, I believe. And yes, it's a plastic bottle, you know, I'm trying to create do as good as I can, okay? But it's like, I'm not there with having glass bottles and all that, but it's better than nothing. Like I said in the start of the video, it's like, do what you can, okay? So this is what I could do with good ingredients, very good ingredients, but the container, it is plastic, okay? It is plastic, it's not glass, but it is what it is. Look at all other skincare products. The majorities are in like plastic containers, okay? I mentioned before it is suitable for all skin type and just because it's a face wash you could use it on your body also but i mean it's up to you and i did forget to mention it is dermatologically tested also and the ingredients we have chamomile flower extract we have sea buckthorn fruit extract we have cloudberry fruit extract and more and like look at my website you can see all the ingredients there okay you guys and it is a sustainable product so we this product is considering all the factors when it comes to the environment okay so that's a little bit about our sensitive skincare cleanser, you guys. Like I said, contact me preferably on my Instagram, on Messenger there, but comment down below if you're interested. And yeah, that's a little bit about that. I'm going to end off this video now because I can't stand the banging right now with all the hammering. Um, so yes, um, there was something else I wanted to say, but I don't know what it was. Oh yeah, when it comes to shipping, we are not really there yet. I mean, it's a lot. Of headaches to be honest i mean the prices are crazy but for now i ship mainly in europe and the states but if you live outside of those areas please contact me and we can see what we can try to do but we're not there yet okay um yeah um and yeah if you're interested in doing a collab if you believe in my products and believe in me it doesn't bite to contact me because i think there is space for us to win together just because i've created skin products when there's a billions when there are many many other skin products out there i honestly believe there's space for new there's place for new products all the time look at all the skin products that have that have come out since you've been born right when i was little the top ones i knew was like nivea and dove and then l'oreal um maybelline but look at everything else that have come out i remember i was younger like nyx came out um my goodness Kylie Jenner's makeup, Jayla's makeup, Rihanna's makeup, skincare and, and all that. So I'm just saying there's there's space for us to win, the space for us to grow. And what I'm trying to say there is just because you are a newbie as a content creator or the word influencer, I like the word inspire more because we are here to inspire other people. Um, if you're interested to possibly doing collab, reach out to me preferably on Instagram Messenger. So Follow me at kivana.co on Instagram and write to me there if you would like to know more about possible collaborations. I've had some girlies reach out to me and would like to do some collabs, which means a lot to me because it means that they get my vibe. They get what I stand for at Kivana. Kivana is be your happiest self. It doesn't have to be your best self, be your happiest self. And Kivana is inspired because of my daughter. So just because it's skincare now, it's going to be bigger, baby. You just wait. I want to bring in products from Australia, where I grew up, products from the Philippines, where my mother is from, and inspiration from Sweden, and things that just make you feel good. Yep, you guys just wait and see. Yes, dreaming away, but let's make our dreams our realities, okay? Take care, everyone. Follow me. Contact me. Get back to me. You know the drill. And remember, always be you. Peace.